Hello, beautiful souls, so I see you. Having this kind of bold new beginning, but also for some divine feminines you. Might be a little bit in a restless energy sometimes because there is this. Awareness spiritually and energetically that you have gone through this powerful transformation and so it's almost like subconsciously your being is signaling to you okay the transformation has been completed and we're ready now to reveal ourselves to the world we're ready to get out there and connect with other people find our people reveal our new self to the world so there might be a little bit of this restless energy a newfound desire for deep soul authentic Connection expressed physically in the actual 3D world, whereas the period of time you're coming out of most likely involved a lot of hermiting, a lot of going really within yourself someone. Could have Sagittarius energy in their birth chart here, but again, I just see. This possibly repper is representing this. Very bold fiery, but also detached energy. Detached meaning surrendered meaning you aren't heavily attached to any particular outcome, any particular timeline, you're very open to possibility. Here is what I'm picking up from Undivine Feminine. Now this other person wants to come off that way they want to, come off as free-floating as someone who doesn't want to be attached, doesn't want to be tied down, but the problem here is, even if they're acting that way in the physical 3D world, deep down that's really not how they Feel I'm going to refer to that person as a masculine energy here because I am picking up a bit of a masculine energy from them now, of course, this could be reversed in your situation, but this masculine they are wanting you to believe that they are very free floating, possibly that they have a lot of options, that they're not really attached to you or to anything that's really how they come off. I'm hearing the word dismissive. You might feel a dismissive energy from this person in the 3D, but the thing is, their innermost self, their soul feels very opposite of this, whereas in the 3D, they're trying to present themselves as someone who doesn't want to get too attached. The truth is this person already is very much attached to a particular outcome here that they've not been communicating. I see that still represented by this happy family card, so can I get more information on what this masculine is thinking or feeling there, terrified of losing themselves in this connection or in another person, which I feel might be why this person shies away from getting into a committed relationship if they are in a committed relationship they are with someone at the moment if they're in a relationship. If they are not in a relationship which I feel is very likely for many of the masculines coming through here, then the reason that they keep that status outside of relationship is because they are really afraid of again losing themselves from divine muscular type yes. If you believe my beloved love, but the thing here is they've been really thrown off by connecting with you either energetically, physically, mentally. However, the two of you have been connecting, it's actually causing this person to already feel as though in a sense they are kind of losing themselves. Now that's how their conscious mind is perceiving this ego death that you've ignited within them so their conscious mind is a bit confused because they don't fully consciously understand the concept of a spiritual awakening and an ego death, but that's exactly what's happening within them. So while they're going through this ego death, they might just pull away from you, divine feminine, thinking that you are the source of this ungrounded feeling or of this chaos they've been experiencing emotionally of this long loss of self that they've been experiencing, but really it's the energy between the two of you and the spiritual awakening that this person is going. Through that is causing this process to be taking place within them. It's a really powerful energetic shift. Happening I'm hearing happening through. This silence, so this may be a masculine, who isn't even communicating very much in the physical three to world, but this 
process is happening within him all the same again. He's consciously aware of how he's feeling of how his sense of self is beginning to fall apart. Something's beginning to unravel here. There's this ungrounded feeling, but he doesn't really attach it yet to the concept of an awakening or an ego death. He just recognizes that it began happening around the time he connected with you divine feminine. So here we have deceit in the reverse position sitting on this person's heart space. So there's some kind of powerful truth here on their heart. I feel like this is something maybe they've been actively trying to hold back, but that wants to be pushed forth to the surface. This is something that they think about communicating from time to time that they want to communicate, but I'm going to channel a bit more into this. What is this truth on this person's heart space? Okay, we have rest and rejuvenation. Upright and woman holding a heart. Upright so rest and rejuvenation, I see. This representing when this person is alone with themselves when they are either about to fall asleep or when they are waking up in those times when they can't distract themselves with anything. In the physical 3D world, they firmly recognize that you divine feminine are the one holding their hearts and on. Hearing them say, and I like it, it's like, they're terrified of the fact that you seem to have such a hold on them. Emotionally, and yet there's a part of them fats, there's a part of them that really has always dreamed dread that someone would come along and make them feel the way that you are making them feel, but I do feel this is someone who may try to distract themselves consciously during the day with other things, possibly 